I'm going to do everything step by step, guys. Um, it really don't matter what order you put it in. It just, um, as long as everything get blended in here. I'm going to do this and this and I'm going to do it like Fuck ça à l'enfant, fuck ça à l'après. Depuis tout bagaille, yo, ça que là, yo, blendé dans ça, ou gagne épice. So, of course, you rinse off your stuff. Rinse off everything. Then I lash ton bagaille. Toujours rinse, yo. Si tu n'as pas de marquette, il y a combien d'autres personnes qui ont de marquette? Il y a d'autres personnes qui ont de marquette. Tu n'es pas le seul. Fais-le que tu utilises tout ce que tu utilises. C'est juste quelque chose que j'ai appris de ma mère. Elle était très picky. Elle a toujours fait en sorte que tu utilises ce que tu utilises. Je même toujours apprendre dans tout épice, dans n'importe manger, especially Haitian food. I always learned that garlic is a big factor. Là, son bagage, son pièce important dans manger. Si tout pour manger haïtien, dans n'importe manger, en plus monde pas comme ça, là, garlic plays a big factor. Là, là, son gros, gros, gros épice lié dans n'importe manger. Là, zonion, c'est gros, gros remède lié pour n'importe manger. Garlic and onion, guys. Garlic and onion is a big, big factor. The more garlic you put, the more flavor you get. To be honest. A lot of people don't know that. They just, um, they just, they, a lot of people don't know that, to be honest, a lot of people don't know that. This is parsley, pesci, pesci. This is also parsley, but this is an Italian parsley. Ça c'est pesci lié tout, mais c'est pesci italien. This is not important. This is not important. So if you want, you take, this is what you need. These. Brun style pas important, mais ça qui est important. Ou trié. So now, I added garlic and parsley so far. I'm getting a bit lime, getting a bit pesci. Kunyan bra lache, zoyon. Now I'm gonna use onion. Can you guys see this properly?
everyone makes their seasoning a certain way. Me, I was raised a certain way. Everyone makes their seasoning a certain way. Chaque monde fait épicé en jean. Moi même, je suis venu à la maison. Je suis venu manger. Je suis venu à un restaurant. Je suis venu à manger un peu. Donc, je ne suis pas un cordon bleu. But I can. If I cook, you'll eat it. Hey, ma cordon bleu, non? But si je mange, je mange. Si je mange, manger, mange. Yep, mange. Now, I'm going to blend this first. I'll blend this out because I don't have a big blender. I do, but I'm not trying to make too much seasoning. I'll blend the premier portion. After that, I'm going to add the rest of the stuff. Guys, big key, another big key. As soon as I can get this up. Okay. Another major key. Right? On l'autre gros secret. Pas utiliser vinaigre, l'op fait manger. L'op fait épice. C'est soit utiliser zo ici ou bien de l'eau citron ou bien on peut citron mettre là-dedans. Do not use vinegar. Don't use vinegar. Do not use vinegar when you are making apis. It's either you use sour orange or the lemon juice. Don't use vinegar. Pas servi avec zoins. Et pas servi avec vinaigre. Vinaigre parfait épice. Pour moi. Pour moi, vinaigre parfait Fin, you know, it's not finished, but just because this is not big, so I can add the rest of the stuff that I need to add in it. You guys don't have to be scared. Don't you don't you don't have to worry. Whatever you're adding in it, um, you're gonna mix everything back up. Even if it's little by little, you're going to mix everything back up. Remove the head. Um, there's certain people keep that don't like spicy food. I don't like spicy food. But the seasoning must have some sort of spice. Haitians, growing up in a Haitian household, they're very picky about cleaning stuff. So we don't use this, we take this off. 
that extra stuff, we take it all. This is also called green onion, I think. Like I said, when you're using the parsley, you don't want the stems. You just want the leaves. You just want the leaves, guys. Also, this is my first video. My first video making seasoning. Okay, that's enough. Sorry guys, the video got cut off. Someone was calling me. Another thing, guys, depending on the dish you're making, how big it is, the portion, seasoning goes by portion, right? Seasoning goes by portion. If you're making a bigger dish, you use more portions. This is the part where a lot of people um, go wrong. I'm going to add a, a, a few cubes of Maggie, probably like three, like three of them. I'm going to use three. All of this will stay as I'm cooking the dish. You don't want to put too much um, salt in your season because you don't know. As you're cooking, you're going to add more ingredients. You're going to add more stuff. So you don't want it to be too salty. I am going to use this onion. Like I said before, garlic and onion plays a big role in seasoning. Garlic and onion. The seasoning will not have its full taste yet until you add salt. Salt, when I say salt, I mean Maggie. This is what we use. 
if you want I use seasoned salt just a little I use complete seasoning And that's it. Your lemon juice. And now you're going to blend it again. I have more, I know, I know, I know. And to be honest, that's about it, guys. That's about it. Um, everyone does seasoning their own way. Everyone does seasoning a certain way. But if you do this, this is like everyday seasoning. I use this in eggs. I use this in rice. I use this in meat. I use it in everything. This is like the, 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 the key. The key. Um, of course, while you're cooking, you're going to start adding more stuff like salt, um, whatever, whatever else you like to use. But this is the base. This is the whole thing. Again, I'm going to tell you, don't add too much salt. Now, because a lot of people don't know how to control, um, how can I say that? Their salt. So you're going to add salt as you're cooking. You put it, you season the meat, you add some salt, you taste it. If it's not to your flavor yet, you add more salt until you until you like it. So that's it for now. Thank you guys for watching me, Kitchen the Wool. Um, 
I'm gonna make more videos. Um, my next video will be making Haitian macaroni, which we call in Long Island, my language, gratiné. Thank you guys.